Good morning and welcome to the Tuesday, September 5th edition of VTV News. Hope you had a restful Labor Day weekend. I'm Nick and here are the morning announcements. Travel Club will be hosting its first meeting today after school in room 223. All interested should attend. Calling all seniors, submit your tasteful and appropriate class of 2018 t-shirt design to the first floor office in building floor. The design must be on white paper with a one color design. All designs are due by September 16th. VHS Interclub Council, the ICC, will meet for the first time this year tomorrow, September 6th at 2.30 p.m. in room 340. All clubs and organizations should ensure that their designated ICC representative attends. All other clubs, leaderships, including sponsors, are also welcome to attend. Information about this year's policies and procedures for club-related activities, including fundraising, will be presented and discussed at the meeting. Looking for a job? Stop by Miss Brantley's room 4204 and take a look at the job postings board. There just might be the right job on there for you. Picture days for the 9th through the 11th grades is this Thursday and Friday, September 7th and 8th. Make sure you have your picture order forms and please look nice. And now for more morning announcements, here's my co-anchor, Ethan Brown. Thanks, Nick. Row Kappa National Social Studies Honor Society will be accepting membership applications for this school year until this Friday, September 8th. A 3.5 unweighted GPA for social studies classes and a 3.5 unweighted overall GPA is required for membership. Meetings are held the fourth Wednesday of each month. Pick, a, pick up an application from Ms. Frimmel, Ms. Kirpchar, Ms. Rolf, or Mr. Johnson if you are interested. The first Spanish Honor Society meeting of the year is Thursday, September 14th at 7.05 in the Tala Lab 4262. This is the same day as our introduction ceremony for our new members in the VPAC at 7 p.m. New inductees will need to be at the VPAC by 6.40 sharp. Semi-formal attire is required. Current National Honor Society members will have their first monthly meeting of the school year this Thursday, September 7th at 7.05 in room 4262. Please be prompt. For any juniors or seniors interested in applying to the National Honor Society this year, there will be an informational meeting on Tuesday, September 12th at 7 a.m. in the Telelab, room 4262. We will have applications available and we'll discuss the application process. The Art National Honor Society will meet on Wednesdays in room 138 from 2.30 to 4 p.m. New members are welcome. Now for today's weather and sports report, here's Priscilla. Thanks, Ethan. The better weather continues today as we'll see some scattered thunderstorms and a 40% chance of rain throughout the morning. Pretty much the same thing we've been seeing, but tonight only the rain chances of it goes up to 60%. Today's high is 91 with a low of 76. The VHS boys golf team earned a big victory last Thursday as they defeated Baron Collar Riverview and Charlotte in a quad match at Venetian Golf and River Club. Low score was Dean Badger who shot a match low of 35. Way to go, guys. The JV football team rolled over Riverview on Thursday night, defeating the Rams 48-12. Nice win to kick off the season. <clears throat> the Lady Indian volleyball team broke a four-match losing streak to rival Riverview with a 3-1 victory on Thursday night. Senior Kelly Hubbard led the way with 18 kills, while junior Caitlin Montgomery finished with 15 kills and three blocks. Nice go. The team heads to Brandon River for a big matchup against the rival Pirates tonight at 7 p.m. Good luck. The cheerleaders are back selling breast cancer awareness shirts for $10. See Coach Amber Wideline, Coach Foster, or any cheerleader to order yours before September 15th. Let's send it back to Nick for the rest of our morning announcements. Thanks, Priscilla. There will be a softball parent meeting tomorrow at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. Anyone who is interested in joining Interact this year, there is a prospective member meeting on September 12th in the Tell Lab 262 at 515. Grades 9 through 11 are welcome. We hope to see you there. Don't forget that the ACT is this Saturday. Be on time and ready to test. Good luck. The next FBLA meeting will be on Monday, September 11th. If you are interested in joining, come to the meeting or see Ms. Zubik in room 106, Building 1 for more information. The Sarasota County College Night will be held this Thursday, September 7th from 6 to 8 p.m. in Robarts Arena at the Sarasota County Fairgrounds on Fruitville Road. Over 100 colleges, universities, technical and vocational colleges will be represented. All students and families are welcome to attend. College representatives will be visiting Venice High School throughout the fall. Take advantage of these opportunities to learn about the college's admission process, academic programs, scholarships, and more. 
All visits take place in the Rotary Futures College Resource Center and students must have their teacher's permission to attend the presentations. This Thursday, September 7th, Hofstra University will be visiting at 8 a.m. and Florida State University will be visiting at 11 a.m. On Friday, September 8th, the following colleges will be on campus. Rollins College at 9 a.m., Florida Institute of Technology at 11 a.m., and Florida Polytechnic University at 12 o'clock noon. For more information, stop by Rotary Futures to check out the college visit calendar. And that'll do it for today's episode of VTV. For Ethan, Priscilla, and the rest of us at VTV, I'm Nick. Have a great day, Venice High.